so here's the code walkthrough. Uh, there's another video showing a demonstration of this uh, this app, but uh, or the sketch, I should say. Um, this is a processing sketch to work with the RocketBot robot controller app for the Android phone, uh, and it's just to demonstrate that the um, uh, anything with a, a, a serial connection and a Bluetooth connection can uh, can can talk to this app. Um, so here's what we've got. Import processing serial. Fire up the serial. Simple enough. Name your serial port something. Here's a few variables to work with. Um, here is the uh, the size of our little window we're going to be using, background, et cetera, et cetera. Now here is a good one. Um, name of your port, new serial, right here, COM8. This is uh, this needs to be changed to the COM port of the Bluetooth connection on your computer. Uh, uh, my Bluetooth is COM8. That's what I've got in there. Um, and then your baud rate. Okay, here is your main loop. Um, if serial is available and it's greater than one, that means there's well most likely two bytes in, and uh, that means you've received a a send from the phone. Um, we're going to go ahead and read those two bytes, and we're going to stick them in these two variables. The first one that comes in is going to be the qualifier, and the second one that comes in is the data byte. We're going to go ahead and print them to debug, and then based on what the qualifier is, we're going to go ahead and make our first decision. So if the qualifier is an A, or 65, um, that means it's one of the auxiliary buttons. And so let's let's go through. What we've actually done is put a switch case inside of a switch case here. Um, the second one right here, we're going to switch what we do based on the uh, the second byte that comes in, the data byte. It can be either in this case a one, two, three, or four, because there's four auxiliary buttons. If it's the first button, we're going to change our dot to uh, red, or change our dot to blue, or change our dot to green. Uh, and then if it's the fourth button hit, we're going to um, do the background command, which clears our little window. All right. Now, if the qualifier comes in as an X or a Y, what we're going to do is we're going to take the data byte, stick it in a uh, little temporary available or temporary temporary variable um, that we're going to use to convert the number we need to fit the screen that we have. Same thing with Y. And then at the end of our little loop, we're going to go ahead and draw that dot on our screen based on the position, the XY position, which is the um, angle of the tilt joystick on the phone. So there's a quick code walkthrough on the processing demonstration sketch for the RocketBot uh, Android app. Uh, please see the other video. Um, the one that just says processing demo, I think. But uh, it's whatever video is right next to this video. And uh, you can see the demonstration of the app itself. So that should do it. It's very, very simple. It's like I said, I keep saying it. It's just two bytes coming in. Very, very, very easy to deal with. And, uh, and now you can tie your phone in with um, uh, your GUI or any other kind of, any kind of uh, uh, desktop project that you might be working on. So there you go, and thanks for watching.